expectations from 1 to 10. Let's go to the kitchen. We can find so many vegetables in the kitchen. Let's choose carrot and count the carrot pieces. We have taken the carrots. Let's count the carrots. Here we can find 1, 2, 3. 3 carrots we can find. So next, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 carrots we can find. So 3 carrots and 7 carrots. Let's add this to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So total we can find 7. 7 plus 3 that means 3 carrots and 7 carrots. Total 10 carrots we can find here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Total 7 carrots we can find out by adding these 3 carrots and 7 carrots. We got 10 carrots. Let us take another example. First we have taken 4 spoons and again 2 spoons. Let's see how many number of spoons we have together. First we have taken 4 spoons and again 2 spoons, 4 spoons, 1, 2, 3, 4 and again 2 spoons we have taken along with 4. Next number is 5 and 6. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Total 6 spoons we have. So when we add this 4 spoons and 2 spoons, we are getting this 6 spoons. So 4 and 2 when we add up. We got the answer of 6. Let's see sign of addition. When we adding these two numbers, we need to put a certain symbol to add the things. So let's see. This is the picture. This is the sign for addition. When we adding or combining two things, we need to place this symbol between the things. So let's see. There are three cookers. Two. Three plus two is five. And there are three things here. One, two, three and 4, 5. When we add this both 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 we got 5 things together. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So that means what we can understand when we add this 3 and 2 we will be getting the answer of 5. So 3 plus 2 is equal to 5. Let us take another example. We need to count and write this number of spoons we have. We have taken six number of spoons and again we took three spoons let's see how many number of spoons we have together first we have taken six spoons along with that three spoons we have taken so let's count this both one two three four five six seven eight nine so totally we have nine spoons so when we add this both the numbers six and three we got the spoons of 9. So 6 plus 3 is equal to 9. So we have discussed about these two numbers. When we adding these two numbers, we'll put the operation of sign plus. This is a symbol of plus. Let us take another example. We have taken 4 items and 3 items. 4 plus 3. Let's count this both the things 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5, 6, 7. Totally we have 7 items 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So when we add this both the items we got 7 items. So that means 4 plus 3 is equal to 7. 7 is the final result. Let us take another example. Here we have 3 vegetables. Along with that, more 2 we have taken, 3 vegetables plus 2 vegetables. Let's see totally how many we have, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So total we have of 5 vegetables, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So when we add up this 3 and 2, we got the 5 vegetables. So 3 plus 2 is 5. So when we add, 3 and 2 will be getting the answer of 5. Let us take another example. Here we have of 4 vegetables. We will add up one more to that. So 4 vegetables plus 1 vegetable. Let's count 
1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So total we have 5 vegetables. So that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And along with that 1. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 5 vegetables we have. 4 plus 1 is 5. So finally we have 5 vegetables. Let's take another example. Here we have 6 onions. Along with that, we have taken more 4 onions. 6 onions plus 4 onions. Let's add them. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Let's write here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Along with that, 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. So all together we have placed here. So when we place this all, let's count this together. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So when we add this 6 onions and 4 onions, we got this 10 onions. So 6 plus 4 is equal to 10. So final answer is 10 adding 1. When we add 1 to a number, we get the number just after 8. Let's see how it is possible. Here we have three birds. Along with that, one more one more bird is present. So three birds plus one bird. So how many words we have? Let's count. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, four. So total we have four birds. By adding this all, three birds and one bird, we got one, two, three, four. Four birds we got. So what we understood from here is when we add 1 to 3 so we got the next number after 3 is 4 let's see by taking another example 5 plus 1 5 plus 1 is what can be the answer is 6 so 6 will get the number after 5 only so what we understood we get when we add a number 1 to any number so we get a number immediately after what we are adding to that number so next one 9 plus 1 is 10 10 is before the number of 9 so when we add the number 1 to 9 we got 10 Similarly, 7, 7 plus 1 is equal to 8. In this manner, when we add 1 to a number, we get the number just after 8. Let's see in the next module.